Happy, happy Wednesday, everybody. Welcome to Miles Dyer Live. This is indeed episode 100. Oh my goodness. I can't believe we're here. Um, Because that's a lot of weeks. (laughs) I think there's only been two weeks since this started that um, we skipped. Um, And uh, yeah, as we were approaching this day... uh, um, amongst the the busyness that has been my uh my my work life and also project life um as you know i've been doing lots of live streaming at the weekends um there was this sort of looming cloud of anticipation for this episode of i've got to do something special um but what am i actually going to be able to get done and so this evening after work i was um scurrying around uh trying to put together a little something um, but I've also got some plans throughout the show uh, to make this one a little bit special. Um, but I just want to say hi first to everyone in the chat. And if there was ever a reason to hit the like button, surely it has to be today for episode 100 of Miles Dyer Live. Yes, I'm Miles Dyer, the host. Uh, and every Wednesday we get together live where we talk about topics ranging from the fun, could be quizzes, movies, games, you name it to the serious maybe it's mental health and well-being life hacks world events there's always something to talk about but what makes this show what it is is the community it's you um without you uh it wouldn't be that great (laughs) honestly and uh some of you have joined only in the last couple of weeks some of you have been here months some of you have been here right from the start but no matter when you joined know that i'm incredibly grateful for you spending a bit of time out of your day with me where we get to uh, enjoy ourselves Um, and even if you aren't someone who watches live and watches on replay I do read the comments Um, and even if you're not someone that tends to leave comments or anything and just watch or now listen because this is now on YouTube music under the podcast section um, just know that I'm grateful for your support Um, so yeah much love uh, to everyone in the chat Um, but before we get to any housekeeping and things like that um i just want to say thank you hello happy wednesday how are we doing everyone are we doing well when you guys um show you know your appreciation to me on here it it means the world it really does um so yeah on that note uh, i'm gonna bid you all good night have a great week and uh love respect and empathy bye bye and that's it for the show uh bye 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 everyone i'm heading off nope um i have to say putting that together watching it back now not gonna lie could feel it in my eyes um this has been one hell of a journey and especially when you look and it's why i sort of end with the sort of clip of me at the very beginning this studio alone has gone through such a transformation uh in the 100 episodes um but even the way that it's structured um i think it's very easy to get lost uh on the moment to moment because i'm always someone that's wanting to push forward there's always more things i want to get done there's always lots of suggestions great suggestions from the community about things we could be doing left right and center um and i want to do them all but the truth is you have to sort of practice self-compassion you have to uh, take your time with it um and you know i've always said progress is something you recognize when you look over your shoulder and my goodness what a difference that has been so um, i'm just gonna have a quick read through the chat but before i do actually read that i just want to sort of you know front this show with my huge thanks obviously huge thanks goes to you the viewers without you here um it would be a little bit lonelier on on camera for me 
I want to say a huge thank you to all the mods and all your hard work. And you might think, what hard work? You know, you just get to hang out in the chat. But you do have to keep your eye out. Um, you know, the chat is usually wonderful, so I guess it makes your jobs easier. But whether it's on Discord or in the chat, I'm really, really grateful. Uh, and especially Karina, who's always um, uh, heading it up. And uh, and Kiro as well. Huge thank you with, with Discord and everything there. Um, obviously, I have huge gratitude for all the guests that have been on uh, since the beginning um there's been a handful i'm not going to go into specific numbers for a, a reason that will become uh, obvious later on in the show um but people that you know take some time out of their day to join me on camera and have discussions um i realize that is definitely something i want to do a lot more of uh, i think it adds to the vibrancy and variety of the show so the guests i want to say thank you to them uh i want to say thank you to ecam uh they're the broadcast um organization that i use their system of okay on the one hand i do pay them for this service so um you know i, I get what i pay for but the ecam community is so amazing and so supportive and have been um definitely a huge part in the quality of my production values with this show and then also i want to say thank you to luria petrucci um and the whole uh, live stream praise community um a community that is amazing for sharing um ideas and uh, advice especially when it comes to tech setup and luria um has been a complete godsend for me especially in the early days whenever i got anxious about where do i even begin with tech setups um she gave me great advice she didn't always give me direct answers because it's always about you know giving you the the choices so you can make an informed decision yourself um, but the LSP community has been amazing. And then obviously I've got to say a huge thank you to Brian Poole, um, AJ, uh, Wes, um, and obviously for the late Dave Station um, with the whole uh, PSVR without parole community and the community there, all the game cats. Um, I was doing this show, you know, um, I think a few months before. Um, actually, maybe it was like five or six months before I joined um, without parole but this definitely um, has um, thrived because of the great uh, community of PSVR without parole and so I, I'm really grateful to them and I'm, I'm so grateful to be a part of that family um, I got thanks to all the it's to PlayStation Sony who have put their faith in me when it comes to PlayStation virtual reality and obviously the devs that have invited me uh, to their various places around the world uh, to check out all the great stuff they're working on um, and then finally, just a huge thanks to my uh, place of work, CybeSafe, who, although, you know, we do a lot of amazing content together, they're always really supportive and give me the freedom to still, you know, do these things um, in my free time. But still, um, they allow me to um, flourish as a, a as a content creator. And I have a lot of amazing um, colleagues there who are very supportive of me, um, not just professionally, uh, but emot emotionally as well. Uh, and so, yeah, I guess you could say I could have summarized that by saying thank you to everyone. Um, but I just wanted to sort of take a moment off the front um, because uh, this is a milestone, uh, pun intended. Um, and this is, I feel like, you know, the launch of another great hundred episodes. And when I look at how far it's come in just the last hundred, um, where we're going to be in another hundred, um, it's it's kind of exciting to uh, to, to think about. Um so uh, Amnesia Pete says the whole show is going to be just takes from the previous episodes. Oh, can you imagine that? I just like play VT and things like that, right? Um, <laughs> Looper says, yeah, from me signing off from that video. Yeah, it was great. Till next time, till next time. Uh, Atmos VR, thank you, thank you. Um, Cali Timecat, always appreciate, and especially all the timestamps that you help with. Uh, Karina, obviously, much love to you. You've been very, very supportive. Uh, App UK, thank you, thank you. Roy, good to see you here. Uh, oh my goodness, I'm trying to get through all these. Uh, Joshua, good to see you here. Um, Kino said, just saw the Global Empathy episode with Brian. Great shit, much love. Glad you liked it. Um, and thanks for checking that out. Uh, uh, right, oh, sorry, got so much going on here. So much going on here. Um, but yeah. And obviously, a huge thanks to Mark, who's always, always... And actually, he made me laugh um, the most out of any time. I'll see if I can dig that clip up. I was actually going to try and put it at the end of the video, but just editorially, it worked keeping it as it was. Um, but yeah, uh, and Serial Killer, good to see you here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
Quick bit of housekeeping, then I'll explain how today's episode is going to work. Um, please do hit the like button if you haven't already. Um, do subscribe um, and ring the bell to be notified about all future episodes on Wednesdays, but also because I do a lot of live streaming at the weekends now. Um, I've just fallen underneath 48,000 subscribers. Uh, many of you know the story. The quick summary of it is th this channel is like over 17 years old and it will be 17 years of vlogging for me in August. And what it means is since sort of getting back into the game the last couple of years, although I'm building an audience on here, uh, I've got a lot of subscribers shedding off that are either dead accounts or people that just you know aren't interested anymore, which is totally cool. Uh, and so it means as I'm gaining subscribers, I'm also losing. Uh, and I keep crossing 48,000 subscribers again and again. And uh, I've just gone under it. So if you haven't subscribed and you're watching this, help me out, subscribe. I really, really appreciate you for it. Um, be sure to join our Discord if you're on uh, Discord. It's called Empathy Arcade, where we talk about pretty much anything. And also like to um, have fun with, with lots of fun and games as well. Um, link is in the description. If you have any questions around Discord, feel free to ask in the chat. Lots of helpful people here or on the comment section. And I'll respond uh, if I can afterwards. Um, housekeeping. These are some links that you can stay in contact with me. You can email me, uh, contact at milesdire.com. Um, whenever you're using hashtags online, use hashtag milesdirelive or quest for empathy. Um, and I'm primarily active on Instagram and Twitter, but I am on Facebook as well. Uh, you yeah, had the curse of the 47 to 48k subscriber boundary thing. I mean, my objective by the end of the year was to hit 50,000 subscribers. I mean, you know, I, I've been trying to, I've been around 48,000 since the start of the year, so it might not happen, but I'm still determined. And there's a lot of signs that, especially with all the live streaming I'm doing, that things could, um, could start to build um, as well. You might see that's pinned in the live chat. There is a link to um, a puzzle. And that's because most weeks, not every week, uh, wow, you've been doing good here, already done the face. Um, we have this puzzle game, and the way it works is you click block, you click another, and if you move it into the right place, it'll go green. If it goes red, it means you've moved it out of the right place to a wrong one. Uh, and there were 510 pieces. Uh, there are 259 left. Um, you don't need to log in to use it, I don't think. Could be mistaken there. Uh, but the uh, link is uh, pinned in the chat and if you need it again I'm sure someone else can post it um, let's see if we can complete this by the end of the show but I know what you're thinking words on stream you remember that old chestnut are we going to play that if you stick around towards the end of the show we're going to give it another go um, like good old times right what else have we got am I going to go to let's plays no I'm going to talk about something else first um, I need to catch up uh, with some of these super chats. We had memberships as well, didn't we? Oh my goodness. Right, I want to say a huge thank you to uh, Joshua uh, for the 199. Uh, I'm just going to start marking these down now for a reason that will become apparent in a moment. Um, thank you. Take a breath and feel the love. I do feel the love. Uh, thank you very much, Silver Nexus. You're always very, very kind. Uh, that's another one there, 999. Wow, may you have hundreds of more and be well rewarded. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And uh, Joshua Taylor was a gifted membership by Mark. Thank you, Mark. I'll mark this down here. No pun intended there. Uh, have I missed anything else? No, I don't think I have. Okay, I should probably get to this then before anything else. You may have noticed, I talked about this for a while. I have got a little game for us to play. I say for us to play, it's for me to play um, in this live show. This is called Bean Boozled. Um, I don't know if you know, know about this, but the way that this works is we have all these uh, jelly beans, but we have this spinner. And uh, if I spin it, it stops on something. And if it like stops on a color, it means that it's going to be either really tasty or really disgusting. So, for example, we have pomegranate or old bandage. We have, like, peach or bar flavor. Birthday cake or dirty dish water. We've got strawberry banana smoothie or dead fish. Um, 
but you might be thinking, well, Miles, how how are you going to decide when to eat these? Because obviously you're not going to want to gobble them up uh, too quickly. So the way that this is going to work is um, I have this little list here. And basically, throughout this show, the more memberships, more of you that click the join button, and if you click join, it's the cost of about a coffee a month, and you unlock um, membership perks like uh, emojis and badges. For every membership or super chat, I'm going to give a tick here. And basically, every time we get to another one of these, I do another jelly bean. So I'm already going to do two. So to do the first jelly bean, I only needed one. To do the second, I need two. Now we need to do three. And so on and so on. I've, I've done it up to um, 15. I don't think we're going to get that far. But then again, I, I've learned never to underestimate uh, the generosity uh, of the chat. But also their willingness to see me do disgusting things. Um, so um, I guess we should um, uh, we should just get on with uh, spinning the first one, right? So here we go. The first one was buttered popcorn or rotten egg i feel like i need something to spit it out into if it's gonna be... <laughs> oh my god right so it's uh buttered popcorn or rotten egg um oh jesus christ paul paul <sighs> here's me looking like this here's me looking like this Oh my goodness. Right, I just want to make sure I don't lose any of these. I was like this. I was like this. Um, oh my goodness. Okay, well, let me open this packet. And then I should probably get to the other things before. Oh my God. Paul, Paul has been very generous, done a lot of gifting. Um, <laughs> right, I've opened it up now. Right, I'm going to pour them in here. And while I write these in, well, I've got to make sure I get the right one. So it's, um, there we go. That looks it. So it's either buttered popcorn or rotten egg. Ready? Mmm. Mmm. But, but a popcorn. That was good. That was a good first one. Woo. Right. Um, I've got to add twenty here before anyone else starts donating. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Okay. Got to do seven. Stop eating with your mouth open. <laughs> Oh my god. Right. Okay. Right. I'll do I'll do another one now. I'll do another one now. I will I will get through all these. Um here we go. Oh, this one is birthday cake or dirty dish water. Thing is these all look very similar. But it's this one. Okay. Birthday cake or dirty dish water. I mean, I don't know what dirty dish walls to taste like. I think that's birthday cake. Which, on the one hand, you're like, oh, that's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's all really good stuff. But, um... <laughs> it makes me nervous. Right, okay. Let's have a look here. Right, we're going again. We've got to do seven of these. Oh... Okay, this is either strawberry banana smoothie. So either strawberry banana smoothie or 
dead fish. Oh no, this is, I think this is dead fish. <laughs> Yep. Okay. That was dead fish. That was absolutely gross. Oh. Okay. Right. I've got to do seven. No one else has donated, right? Yeah. Anyway, we need we need um five more uh members or super chats to um to do another so I, I don't think there'll be any more for the rest of the show um right i do want to get onto the other things but we'll just do one more and then i'll take a quick break before i do the others oh oh no oh no it's cappuccino cappuccino or liver and onions Cappuccino, which I'm not, I'm not a huge fan of, but better than liver and onions. <laughs> Some people like liver and onions. Okay, okay, I've done four. I've only had dead fish once, so I feel like I got off quite, quite good. <laughs> Everyone is like this, right? I've got two more to do, but before we do that, let's take this moment. Speaking of rotten dead fish. Let's talk about vitamin G, what we're grateful for. I'm grateful for you all making me eat raw raw fish or whatever it was. Absolutely disgusting. Every week we take a moment to think about what we're grateful for in life. Um, I feel like I've already said my piece. I've thanked everyone. and uh, But this is an opportunity for you to talk about what you're grateful for. But while you're all typing in the chat, and you don't have to type, you might just think about it, but just taking a moment to think about someone, a place, an experience, anything that you're grateful for, um, it's really good for your mental well-being. Um, it's good for reflection. So for me, I'm just grateful that I get to do this every Wednesday with all of you. Um, I'm so, so grateful. So um, thank you for tuning in and being so supportive and, and loving. Um, Mojo says, I am grateful for the best community on YouTube, aka you guys, and I'm grateful for your existence, Miles. You're amazing. Hugs. Thank you very, very much. Times Play says, I'm grateful for the internet. Absolutely. Uh, boogers and farts flavor, question mark. I assume that, that was just generally asking, not what you're grateful for. Mark says, I'm grateful for my PSVR 2, as when I'm wearing it, I can't see the wife. <laughs> Amnesia Pete says, I'm grateful for my son. See, there's different ways of appreciating your family. Vitamin G, everyone on here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I love going to Parlay Beach in New Brunswick, Canada, but now the Great Whites are moving in. Oh, oh. Cool. Um, Roy says, I'm grateful for my gardening hobby that keeps me out of my head. Honestly, hobbies that get you out of your head are very, very important. And in some ways, I guess this could be a part of it as well. Um, by the way, you, you've you got 88 left. Everyone else who's been working on this, you're absolutely smashing it, although it gets a bit more difficult towards the end. Um, right, let's do another one of these. Oh, my goodness, it's another cappuccino or liver and onions. Oh, no, this is this is going to be horrible. That's liver and onions. Mm. <laughs> Q 
Karina says, today I'm over the moon being a part of this fabulous community. Never believed in online communities and the last year has opened my mind and heart so much. Never looked back. That means a lot. Thank you, Karina. I'm glad. Glad to have you with us. Right. One more. i got one more to do. And then we've got to get five more uh, donations, uh, members or um, super chats to um, do the seventh. Oh, what happened? Oh no, is it? Has it cut out? One second. Oh no, I pressed that by mistake. My bad. So that wasn't a proper spin. Oh, what's this one? Oh, it's um. Is it peach or bath? Peach or bath? Let's have a look here. Okay. I like peach. I don't know if I like bath though. Oh. Oh. That's sick. Uh Okay. I'm done. That's six done. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. The aftertaste. Oh, I should have had something else to have with it. Um, so this is where we are at the moment, everyone. When we get to seven more memberships or super chats, um, five more, then I'll do another. We've cleared the first page very quickly. Obviously helped by lovely, lovely pool. Right, next up. Uh, is Dire Discoveries. Um, every week I talk about something I've discovered. There were actually two things I wanted to talk about this week, but one of them I've ordered online and it arrives tomorrow, so I'll save that for next week's show. Ooh, teaser. Stay tuned for next week. But um, I actually went to the opticians yesterday because the last four days I've been dealing with a twitchy eye. Do any of you have that? You know, where your eye just starts like... It feels like it's doing it way more than it looks. Um... And, uh, yeah, your eyes twitching. It can last a couple of hours. Sometimes it lasts days, sometimes weeks, sometimes months. So I went to the optician, had the uh, super scan on the eye, where they do a full scan and, like, 3D modelling. Perfect eyes, thankfully. Um, but my, they confirmed a lot of the research that I've done. That, that is, when you have a twitching eye, yeah, lid spasms, um, so some of you have had it, yeah. Um, <laughs> so when your eye does it, there's there's three things it comes down to. Um, oh my goodness, I thought Mark had just bought 10 memberships. He's celebrating 10, which is wicked. And uh, thank you, Mark, for being a, 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 a long 10-month supporter. Um, so thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, oh, magnesium can help with twitchy eyes, taking poor sleep. So I've been told there are sort of three things that it's because. One is stress um it could also be like stress on the eyes i've been doing a lot of vr lately that could be a part of it um secondly caffeine i do drink caffeine but not huge amounts although i had a cappuccino jelly bean there so that probably didn't help um oh is there a bit of an echo is it really bad the echo because it's coming out of my phone that i'm using as this second camera and i've not been able to turn it off uh which is really really annoying so um if so i will just have to turn off the second camera um because for some reason i wasn't able to mute myself on there um and then um cool that's cool i did test it beforehand recording and i couldn't hear it huge but if it is okay some can't hear it some of you probably can hear it now if it does get annoying let me know and i'll just turn the second camera off and i, I just won't use this anymore i'm actually doing this in a certain way normally you can use it as a companion camera, which is what I do for my um, Let's Plays. 
But um, because I haven't updated this operating system on this computer yet, because I want to back it all up before I do that, um, I'm actually dialing into the show as a guest, um, which is why if I do this, you got Jelly Cam. <laughs> um, real men eat something with hot sauce. Well, I like hot sauce. I like hot sauce. But these, uh, what are these candies? These candies, I spin the wheel. And they come with all sorts of flavours. So you can get like pomegranate or old bandage. Peach and bath. Birthday cake and dirty dishwater. Buttered popcorn or rotten egg. Juicy pear or booger. Cappuccino or liver and onions. Strawberry banana smoothie or dead fish. Berry blue or toothpaste. And we got here toasted marshmallow or stink bug or tutti fruity or stinky socks um and so what i do is if i get enough uh, of you donating super chats or becoming members i need five more um i will spin the wheel and eat another i've done rotten fish which i think was the one i was fearing most um so yeah uh, that is it so anyway with um dye discovery um it's very common the twitchy eye but reduce your caffeine, um, spend more time, you know, away from computer screens and that. Um, and they say if it gets really bad, you can just use like a, a nice warm towel on the eye just for a bit to, to help relax it. Um, but it is about straining. And yes, do hit the like button um, if you haven't already. As you all know, people, uh, I have um, been very, very busy with doing Let's Plays. Uh, lots of VR live streams at the weekend. Uh, and they've been... Uh, Really, really fun. The, God, the aftertaste is absolutely gross of that sick flavoured one. Ugh. Um. So yeah, I've got some Let's Plays coming up. Um. Oh wow, has the puzzle been done? Oh no, there's 30 left. God, you are doing really good this week. Well done, everyone. Well done. This week, or this weekend, should I say, doing another six games. Uh, and we've got a real treat. Uh, first up awesome asteroids um and the reason why is because oh interestingly that um my thing is not uh echoing now why has it done that i don't know um but yeah um oh it's actually disconnected that's why <laughs> um awesome asteroids uh reggie uh who developed this um it's coming out on regular psvr uh I think yesterday or today. Um, so I'm going to be celebrating it by playing the PSVR 2 version uh, on Saturday at 5 p.m. UK time, which is 12 p.m. Eastern. Then we're going to rock and roll with some drums rock, uh, which should be good. A uh, bit of music. And then I'll be getting into my uh, driving simulator rig and doing some Gran Turismo. And if you have Gran Turismo, uh, stay tuned because uh, there will be an opportunity for you to join me on the racetrack. Um, and that is just Saturday. That is just Saturday. Then on Sunday, uh, I'm going to put my farmer's hat on and uh, play across the valley and look after a lovely farm in VR. But then things get aggressive. I'm going to put on my night outfit and play Swordsman, um, which is a, a game I absolutely love and will be probably amusing, me playing it uh, on live stream. So Swordsman VR. Uh, and then ending... The weekend with Star Wars uh, Tales from the Galaxy's Edge uh, on Sunday. So that's it. We've got a lot of games. Another six. Um, so do do tune in uh, if you like VR. Um, but there are lots that I've played from the last uh, couple of weeks anyway. Um, including uh, what we played. Um, what games did we do last weekend? We did lots. But including Hubris. Which um, everyone loved watching. And I really loved playing it especially when funny stuff like this happened. Hey, mate. What's in there? Dude, what's in there? What's in there? Dude, what's in there? What's in there? Hey, dude. To the right, yeah? You go in first, and then we'll go. <laughs> Bless you.
that soon. It was good fun. Hubris was a really cool story. Uh, looks beautiful to play. Um, do check it out. Um, it's all on the Let's Play playlist uh, on my YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash miles. Right, everyone. Uh, are we ready for a quiz? Yeah? I have put together a five-question quiz uh, to help celebrate the occasion of 100 episodes. And, uh, oh, the puzzle has been done. Well done, well done, well done. Well done, everyone. Uh, and ignore the time because I had to set it up like um, quite quite a long time before. So you did it in 36 minutes. Very, very, very good. And you did it. You did it indeed. You did it indeed. And I know a lot of people are waiting for me to play Phasmophobia. Uh, and I will be playing it when it comes out. Um, so, yeah. Um, okay, okay. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to the YouTube chat uh, for this quiz. Because what we're going to do is we're going to do it as a poll. Uh, so you can all get involved. Um, so let me just um, go here. And I will put it in the chat. And by the way, if, if anyone does uh, do super chats or membership and I miss it, do flag it because I will write it down. Uh, again, five uh, super chats or um, members. And obviously you can gift members uh, memberships. That is uh, counted as well. Um, five more and then I'll do another jelly bean. I... Sick and rotten uh, and rotten fish is probably the worst, right? Thank you, Karina. Always trust you to to flag it. Uh, right, we're going to start with a poll. Uh, question one. Um, I'm just going to put A, B, or C. Uh, for this, uh, are you ready? Here we go. Question one. What is the song that plays during Miles Dyer live outros? Is it A, Potion Flies? Is it B, Ocean Eyes, or is it C, Lotion Dies? Which one? Which one is it? Is it A, Potion Flies, B, Ocean Eyes, or is it C, Lotion Dies? The answer, and oh my good days, that aftertaste is so gross. It's Ocean Eyes. Uh, well done. You got it. 91% of you got it. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done, chat. Well done, chat. Well done. You got it. You got number one. That was. I, I'm going to say that was a, that was an easy easy one though to begin with. That was an easy one to begin with. I just wanted to just wanted to test you. Yeah, just wanted to test you. Oh my goodness, that jelly bean. Ugh. It's gross. Right. Um, do I have something to drink? I have water. I should probably get something flavoured, right? Oh, wait. I'm not starting a Q&A. Uh, poll. Question. Two. A, B, or C. Uh, here we go. What month did Miles die alive begin? In this format, and what I mean by in this format, uh, oh, someone done a super chat. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you very much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I have just um added okay, four, four away, four away from uh, four away from doing another one. Ugh. Um. I have I have missed two. I have missed two. Um Oh. You're making me doubt now. I've I've missed two definitely. Okay. This is what we're going with, right? Okay. Well, the answer the answer was and someone did the research. 
I did I did the research. I did the research. Um okay, right, we're we're, we're ending it there. You say A. The answer is June. It was June twenty twenty two. Um, and the reason I said in this format is obviously I'd been live streaming a lot longer before that, but that was when things really kicked off because it was just after, it was like the week after England were playing the 2021 World Cup, I think it was. Um, what am I even talking about? It's not even 2022, it was 2021. Ign ignore, the, ignore the year, it was about the month. It was June 2021. Uh, so that was fake news, fake news. Um, but yeah, it was June 2021. All right, moving on to the next one. Um, how many guest episodes have there been so far? As in, how many, um, how many, uh, how many guest episodes in, in terms of an episode where a guest has, has joined me? Um, oh my God, that sick one was so gross. I just, it keeps coming back in waves. Oh, super chat from Salvador. Thank you very, very much. Wow, $10. Thank you very much. Let's go. Congrats. Thank you very much, Salvador. Um, I am now um, adding it. Including devs. Well, just if devs come on, they're guests. Guests are people that come on the show with me. Um, so, yeah. Just while you're doing that, um, we are now... Three away, three away from another jelly bean. Okay, just three away. Thank you for for the generosity. Um, mm, interesting. The poll disappeared for you. Um, mm, okay. You do actually make me want to um, have a quick look now. <laughs> Where did it go? Where did it go? I had I had this noted down somewhere. All right. Okay. We're ending it there. Uh the answer was 7 seven uh because we had the dev from um oh we can count them we can count them if we go back to here uh where was it, it was this this video here hello
Seven, seven guess, seven guess. Um, I'll put that highlight clip on on my socials afterwards. By the way, if anyone wants to to watch it back, although you can watch it back on here, can't you? Um, okay, uh, right. Uh, moving on. I haven't, uh, let's have a look here. Um, two more questions. Okay. Uh, question four. Uh, let me type it in here. What language? <laughs> what language caused words on stream? to no longer be played um was it spanish was it french or was it latin now for those that don't know we used to play this word game at the end of every uh, live stream and then one time we couldn't everyone failed on level one and we didn't know why and then it turned out it was it was in a certain language and uh <laughs> um yeah and we couldn't fix it so we just didn't play it anymore and it might be the issue we have at the end of today uh right i'm ending it there 81 percent of you said spanish uh the answer was indeed spanish well done well done well done uh okay final question without peaking Without peeking, everyone, uh, what was the first episode of Miles Die Alive about? And I've gone a bit more general. Was it about movies? Was it about music, which could include my band? Or was it a mental health episode? What was it? What was it? What do we think? Oh, wow. Lots of you are voting for C. Right, we're ending it there. Seventy percent of you, or eighty one percent of you, said A movies. No, you didn't. What? Did 80% of you say movies? I thought it was the other way. Oh, no, that was for the last one. Ignore me. Ignore me. 69% uh, of you said C for mental health. Uh, the answer was... It was mental health. There we go. I think you guys got... Uh, did you get two, 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 two out of five or three out of five? What was it? I wasn't keep keeping count. I wasn't. But yeah, the very first one was about um anxiety. It was about anxiety. And uh yeah, my um my my video thumbnails have come a long way because uh yeah, the very first one uh let's have a look here. Um oh, I can't even see it here cuz it's uh, it is zipped away. But uh yeah. It was uh <laughs> saucy number wins the day. Um, but yeah, well done everyone. Nice little, nice little quiz there uh, about previous episodes. Um, someone was asking, are we going to be doing Q and A? Because normally it is Q and A at the end of the month. Um, I'm happy to do some Q and A uh, for the next ten minutes. Then we will go to credits, um, and then um, when we come back, we will do words on stream. Um, but yeah, unless anyone else wants to donate anything and get me eating another one of these, there's lots left, um, which I'll have to have to definitely save. Um, Oh, yes. Um, I say for ten minutes. You know, if it goes a bit longer, it goes goes a bit longer as well. Um, because um, something else I wanted to reflect on really was just about like favorite moments. Um, what have people's highlights been the last hundred episodes? Are there any memories uh, that come to mind? Um, I'm seeing if I've got this. Uh, I mean, look at this. This is a clip I've got from ages ago. Uh, one spin for every words on stream round we get through. Uh, nah. 
I'm not doing that. I'm sticking to the uh I'm sticking to the rules. I'm sticking to the rules thing. Um Hey Hannah, good to see you here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh What was the longest stream show? That was over two hours. Um I, I honestly I have no idea. Uh possibly. If there was a two hour one that does sound like I don't even know what one that was, Kelly. Um uh but yeah, that that does sound like a long one. And also, one of the reasons we got rid of words on stream was it would often go on for half an hour, and so it would increase the live stream like duration by, you know, ridiculous amounts. And the reality is, it hurts the um, performance of the videos because when people watch on replay, they'll switch off at that point. So you you got a video where people aren't watching the majority of it. Um, so that was another reason why we stopped doing it. But we will do it for today because it is a special occasion. Um, here's a random clip I've got from an old episode. Right now in the chat, what is the latest film you have seen in the cinema? For me, it was... I can't. It can't have been... Oh, it must have been um, Multiverse of Madness, uh, Doctor Strange, which was cool. There was things I liked about it, other stuff that I thought was meh. Um, I really wanted to see Top Gun. I hadn't seen the original, but I hear it's amazing on the big screen. It's still in the cinema, but it's on the... I say it's on the smaller screens. It's on the regular cinema screens, and I'm kind of like, do I go and see it? Black Phone. Okay. 1917. Is that the movie that's all done... That's done in one shot? A single shot throughout, right? The Black Phone. Interesting. Jurassic World Dominion. Love and Thunder and Elvis. Top Gun. Okay. Thor. Thor, Love and Thunder. Star Wars The Last Jedi, wow. Twilight, what? Has it really been that long? Do you know what it is that I like about going to the cinema? And I think it says a lot about culture these days. And it's that when you're in a cinema, being told that you're not allowed your phone, it's nice not to have that distraction. Because the amount of times, you know, you try and watch stuff. And um, I'm gonna find this cartoon I found on this exact topic. What content should I consume today? Shows you've already watched but didn't follow because you were staring at your phone. Perfect. <laughs> I love this so much. Follow him on Instagram if you haven't already. Yeah. <laughs>
Yep. Fifty million dollars. Fifty million dollars. What am I going to do with that? Huh? What am I going to do with that? <laughs> yeah, it's um an impressive amount that's probably going to get wasted. I have to bet like a million on red. Yeah, I'll have to do that uh, sometime. I might do that after the live show. I don't know. Um, I need to rest my eyes after this. Um, are all 100 live streams still available to view? Yeah, the uh, the playlist is on my YouTube channel. Um, if you go on there, um, it's all under the podcast tab now, but it is on the, the channel main page as well. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah. Go ham on the slot machines. I mean, you can get certain rooms where you spend a lot on the slot machines, so that'll be quite interesting. Um, but, yeah. Um, cool, cool, cool. Uh, right. Well, I've got this um, <laughs> next to me, which is holding my uh, my phone. I'll put it back here. Um, I guess just to, um, yeah, it, it, it is amazing to see the evolution. I mean, look, if I just go back to some of these episodes, like I'll, I'll load up here now, full episodes. Like we'll just take one at a time, right? We'll we'll take one from like each. So this was this was the very first episode. Reason to be, and especially now I've got this this professional microphone as well. You know, especially when you talk really close to the mic, it can really get the um. I'm gonna say the flavour of the voice, but you get the sort of the depth of it and things like. That. I mean, and, and look and look at this now. Like what an improvement, right? <laughs> Uh, a real trip down memory lane um yeah but if you if you actually go to my channel and scroll down it will say um miles die live every wednesday and that's a playlist and that has all hundred of them in there so um yeah um yeah i do i mean these microphones are quite a few hundred but um makes it makes a big difference makes a big difference um what else was i gonna say yes so looking on like what are some of my hopes and plans for the future with this channel and this community? Um, some of them I've touched upon already because they were on my to-do list. And although for June I wanted to release merch, although yeah, Paul says, glad you stopped sitting in the dark. How dark I was in some of those episodes. I couldn't believe it. Like at the time I was, I thought it's a bit dark, but I thought it's fine. Um, it's amazing when you get real lighting and, and, what, and what a difference it, it, it can make. Absolutely, Paul. Um, some of the things that um, I want to do, um, one is um, I want to get the merchandise up and running. Um, but this, this month, I would say a big success is I've really stepped it up with my Let's Play videos, um, doing a lot of, of, of streaming, and the fact it only happens at weekends works really, really well. Um I want to upgrade my computer here and the one that I use downstairs for my Let's Plays. They're 2017 Max. Um, and they're great. But if I want to have more flexibility with editing and also I want to be able to edit stuff like super quick so I can do like highlight clips and things like that, I need to get Max with Apple Silicon. So I actually was at the, apps, uh, the Apple Store recently and I was inquiring about it and I was looking at my savings and I've decided that I'm going to be getting the new MacBook Pro, uh, which means I can have it set up here. And then I could also have my work laptop put there as well. And it all connects to um, a second screen in front of me. And then it means when I do get work downstairs, I can then just head downstairs uh, with the same laptop. Um, and it will just run a lot smoother and it'll be a lot higher quality for the streams. Um, it's going to set me back... Uh, almost three grand but um i've had these for like since 2017 and i've always said you know i always appreciate the donations that are made but ultimately um you know with my own income and stuff i keep investing into this um and making sure that I, i've got all the the tech and stuff that i need um like because I, I believe in this and if i ever saw it was sort of withering away and there wasn't really a, a demand or it wasn't going well then i would you know obviously not keep investing but so number one um is get merchandise up and running 
number two, um, get a new computer. Um, so I can, and, and actually a new setup here. I have these two massive speakers on the desk that my uh, best friend Hugh gave me, which have been brilliant, but they do take up a lot of space. Um, and I just need smaller ones so I can make room for having a second screen and, and, and things like that. Uh, number three, um, guests on the show. Um, I've just had a th think about like the kind of guests that I want to get on. And there's just so many guests that I could. One example is I could get um, someone that works at a blood bank uh, and ask him to come on and we could do a whole episode about giving blood. Um, I don't know if any of you have given blood before. I've done it. Um, I should do it more often um but like that could be an episode that could be interesting uh bringing on experts and just helping with sort of the themes of the episodes i think having guests on is always really interesting um and it will just help mix things up um and there are a lot of like products that i've bought that i'd love to get people that work on the businesses to come on and talk about you know how they got into it um and well done cali you gave blood yesterday good on you good on you um uh, no worries. Well, I always appreciate you hanging out when you can, uh, Mighty Mim. So uh, appreciate that. Um, and uh, so that so yeah. So um, getting guests on regularly that's another big thing. Um, number four, um, I just want to hit fifty thousand subscribers uh, by the end of the year. Um, and subscribers aren't everything, simply because um, subscribers don't guarantee their people that you know come and you know are engaged in that however the reason it's important to me is the moment i hit 50,000 it will mean that um i have um basically broken the sort of like the lock that has been on my channel for a long time in terms of stifling growth and things like that and i i invest in a lot of courses and things like that and look at you know always doing research when i'm driving around and things like that and i'm just going to give you a look um on the back end of my youtube channel analytics i'll show you this here we go uh right if i go to that and then i switch to here we go so this is where i am at the moment and this is the last 90 days. Now, at, at the side, although you can see it there with, with me on screen, um, you see it's 48K. Um, at, this was at 47. So we're at now 47,996. And it's just constantly, this is like, this is the line that's um, 48,000 here. And that's the last 90 days. If I look at the last 365 days, look at that. I was like at 47. And that was from... Um, if I go to lifetime, <laughs> you can see uh, from 2018, I was literally on the cusp of hitting 50,000. Um, 50,000, and then it's just been a slow decline since. And then since doing the show in June, I'm still hemorrhaging, but it's now starting to pick up. So it's a long process. It's a long process, but that's just to give you some insights of... Um, of how it looks um and what's and what's going on i just thought you'd be interested in seeing that so that's 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 another big thing that would would mean a would, would mean a, a lot um so what caused the peaks um it was big events that i was involved in when videos of mine went viral the the, the massive drops are just where youtube has issues with its tracking um but yeah it's been something i've i've, I've stuck with for a long time um and then uh, the final thing is um, doing more with the Discord community. Um, always diving in when I can. Always great conversations. Uh, but I want to organise like sort of uh, voice chat get-togethers there. Um, and, and also it'd be good to do some community games where um, I set up a server, put the details in a in a chat, and organise a time so that anyone that's wants to play along, we can do that. And even if it's not PlayStation specific, we can always do words on stream together or or, or other games like that. So. Um, there's just a lot there's a lot to be done um and so for me it's like yeah if we can get a good merch range if we can start getting regular guests on the show uh and if i can get past fifty thousand subs um i think it's we're gonna see a real huge improvement with this um which just means a a, a better better show for you as well sas lords just subscribed one step closer and uh yeah it has been noted um 
thank you thank you very very much uh, appreciate that <laughs> anyone else who hasn't subscribed right now you can help this tick along uh just by pressing the subscribe button um but yeah um that is it from me um i want to say a huge thank you to everyone for tuning in today i want to say a huge thank you uh to everyone that donated super chats or memberships paul who gifted 20 my goodness thank you uh good sir um if before the end of the show we do get another three i will spin the wheel again but i've still got the taste of sick in my mouth um <laughs> it was uh pretty horrible but um listen um it's been an amazing hundred episodes um there have been some days i've turned up and really not been feeling it i think there was one where i was actually burnt out and it was only a 30 minute show but i try and turn up whenever i can um and you obviously see only a part of me. Um, you don't see like what's going on behind the scenes, as is the case with online stuff. Um, I work really hard in my job. Um, and uh, oh wow, uh, Mark has donated again. Let me let me have a look. Let me have a look. Uh, where 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 where? Let me have a look. Let me have a look. I'm scrolling up. Um, God, I'm scrolling up. I'm scrolling up. <laughs> Oh my goodness. It's because there's been so much chat. Everyone's been amazing today. Um, I can't see. Right. Oh, at the beginning of the show. Uh, did I not note that one down though? What did Mark, what did Mark donate right at the beginning of the show? Because maybe I didn't log those ones. Because the only one I saw was the um, the the ten month thing. So yeah, Mark, if you let me know what you donated, I will definitely add that. Um, you oh you gifted it. I, I, okay. Uh, oh no, did I did I not? No, I did. I did note that down. But yes, thank you, thank you, Mark. Sorry. Um, and 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 Mark has been someone who's been incredibly kind and donated um, multiple multiple times uh, over the years. And there's there's lots of you that have been donating, and I'm I'm always grateful for it. Um. Uh. Right, and look at this. Thank you very much, everyone. I just hit 48,000 subscribers. Yeah! I have said that must be like 10 times this year, uh, and it will drop down again. Uh, but <laughs> I'm really, 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 really grateful for it. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you're someone that watches this and doesn't have a YouTube account or you do have a Google account, get involved. Say hi in the chat. Um, it's always, always greatly appreciated. And look, it's, it's ongoing. This is really, really good. Uh, I really, really appreciate it. Um, so listen, everyone, huge love to you all. Thank you for spending this 100th episode with me. Um, I was frantically racing after work to try and get everything together. Um, and uh, yeah, um, I enjoyed doing this. And uh, I am really glad that I get to uh, close the box on this. Um, I will open it again if by the end of the words on stream uh, more donations come in. But... It is what it is. Um, and thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Who said unsubscribe? Yeah, you unsubscribed. I oh, know. I've seen that. I've seen that. It's, it's gone back down. It's gone back down. Um, I noticed that. Uh, oh, you shouldn't have done that. But I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Look. <laughs> this is the life that I live. This is the life that I live. Um, I'm not celebrating hitting 48,000 ever again. Ever ever again and uh i've seen it we just hit forty-eight thousand. Okay. all right you're all mean you're all mean uh but i love you for it um everyone i hope that you have a wonderful week a wonderful rest of your june uh next week we return in july what the topic is i have no idea uh but something that i am going to be working on in the coming weeks is just because now I've got everything under wraps, we've hit 47,999 again. Um, be, be, because I've now got this process going with um, my Let's Plays uh, at the weekends, um, that's taken a lot of work because I've basically built this spreadsheet with every PSVR 2 game. I've done thumbnails for all of them, titles, descriptions. It means now scheduling them is a lot easier. It still takes a bit of getting used to in that, um, but that helps a lot. Um, so um, now it means I can look back towards Miles Dyer Live and, and, and get bits and pieces done there. So, yeah, as I said from the beginning, 
incredibly grateful you might think oh i'm just showing up because i like hanging out but i love you for it and uh yeah i will never never take what i do on this uh, channel for granted because when i did my first episode of this i think i only had like three or four people in the chat at any one time uh i mean now we have 33 um and you know that's a massive improvement and uh may may this community continue to grow because um this and empathy arcade is full of people that just like to hang out have fun and uh yeah i love you all for it so on that note have a wonderful week and if you want to play words on stream stick around post credits because then we'll fire it up all right and if it's in spanish then we will call it a day but they've had a lot they've had, had enough time to fix it right cool have a good one everyone love you all peace Thanks for sticking around. Are we ready for some words on stream? I mean, I think we are. It's just, is words on stream ready for words on stream? We're, uh, we're going to find out. So uh, let me uh, just plug this in. Uh, yeah, this is the after show. This is the after show. Uh, let's see how, how we're going to get on. It's been a while. Okay, here we go. Words on stream, uh, I will have to um, change uh, my position because I can get in the way. Do you know what? I'll just be just here. Let's see Let's see how I get on here. If it's, it's bad, I'll move it around. Um, for those that don't know how this game works, we're going to have to make as many words as we can using the letters on screen. Uh, the further we get into the game, uh, we've actually never got to level 21. How about that? It gets very difficult. But the further we go, uh, the more tricky uh, the rules become. So uh, good luck, everyone. Uh, let's give this a go. 
and let me get some music. Absolutely smashing it. Put myself up here. I think that's fine. If I'm here, if I'm here, it's cool. What well up, everyone? Uh, and because we've got three stars, we skip three levels. Level four. Let's do this. I'm just going to get myself a drink while you uh, smash this level because um, that taste is horrible. <laughs> Just one left, just one left. Begins with a T. Could be T-O something. Um, tour. Well done, well done, well done, Mark. We skip another four level, uh, three levels. Level seven. Now there's a fake letter in here, so there's a letter that we're not supposed to use. So whoever gets the longest word will work out what the hidden, uh, that the fake letter is. Notebook, which means P, 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 P is the fake letter. So don't use P. I'll tell you what, if we did complete level 20 today, you've done very well with the puzzle and 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 this as well. Um Thank you. 
Well done, everyone. Absolute smashing it. Mark, Mark leading the way. Level 10. jelly beans with me to work tomorrow from meeting up with people and seeing the rest of them. For those that don't know and are unfamiliar with this, if you do get an answer correct, I should have said that, it locks you out until it until the time goes to another lock and then it unlocks you. Wow, one left. Is that three stars? Should be three stars. Well done. Absolutely smashing this, everyone, but we know how this story goes. Level 13. Unlucky for some. There's a hidden letter and a fake letter. Mascara, well done, Hannah. So that means the hidden one was what? Oh, there's a there's a third A. There's three A's. And you don't want to use the N. Don't use N and use three A's. Wow. And mascara is an anagram as well. Maracas, I wouldn't guess that. What are we doing? Hey Tiff, we are playing Words on Stream. Play along. Level 16. Got to guess. Just type in the chat your guesses. Got to make as many words as we can with, uh, with the letters on screen. But they have to be five letters or more. Yeah, we're doing words. This is going to be a difficult one. Oh, you beat me to coins. Icons is a good one. Sonic. Yeah.
Thank you very much, uh, Silver Nexus. Thank you. That clap should have been a lot louder, but I have the music on, so I have to clap again. Right, everyone, we are two super chats or members away from me doing another jelly bean. Yeah, thank you, thank you very, very much. Let's do that clap again. Thank you, thank you. I've actually spoken with the broadcast people to make it so it automatically saves super chats. Um, right, we're running out of time. We're currently not there yet. We need to do it. Z is fake. E is allowed. Uh, Unfortunately, we've not been successful. Unlucky. Level 16. Look, we're out, we were out of practice, so that was pretty good going. We were going at it pretty fierce, pretty fierce, pretty fierce, but we weren't victorious. Um, obviously, well done to Mark in first place, 157. Then Hannah, then Looper, then, oh, Siago, a uh, joint third, actually. Uh, then we've got Jordan, Mojo... Uh, Nashi, Kristen, Vargasoft, uh, Kira, Amnesia, Pete, Karina, Kanek, me, yeah, uh, Chris, and Kali Timecat. Um, so thank you to everyone uh, that uh, played along. And uh, even if you didn't get one right, just guessing can help everyone else as well. Hey, everyone. Uh, I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone that has come to celebrate episode 100 with me. Um, it's been a wild journey. Um, I will share that highlight video on all my socials after this, I think. I've just got to think of a, a cute little caption to go with it. Um, so, yeah, have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your week. And I will see you on the next one. Love, respect, empathy, and adios. Until next time. Bye-bye.